Hello guys, Rock Ventures here. I'm here at uh, the Chamorro Night Market happening here on Wednesday nights. Um, we're gonna go get some food. Listen. here about a year and a half ago uh, so uh, we're gonna go see what's different and everything um, if you guys want to go to my channel about uh, a year and a half ago it should be somewhere around my channel and everything like that so I'd appreciate it if you guys go and check that out so uh, let's go get some food the other side of um, Chamorro Village um, well actually it's still the same side this is just an extension um, of the, the Chamorro uh, Wednesday night market and everything um, the main one is over there this is just an extension we're gonna go around we're gonna go check what everybody has and then we'll decide then if uh, what actually we're getting uh, for dinner all right here at the Chamorro Night Market and um, there as you can see there's like a lot a lot of people here happening um, from locals to tourists um, Wow it's crazy um, everybody comes here to the Chamorro village on Wednesday nights and everything it looks like everybody does they don't do anything else here on Guam on Wednesday night but the Chamorro village. It's crazy ridiculous. Um, lots of food, lots of people. <laughs> and um, yeah, man, I mean, in order for you to actually get a plate, get something to eat, you gotta line up for quite some time. Um, it, a lot of time. Uh, <laughs> there is also a attra uh, attraction here for uh, for the people. 
uh, for kids, for adults, um, right here, let me show you guys, um, is... It, it, it's a rock climbing thing, I, I guess for kids, not for adults, maybe? I'm not really sure. All the, kid, all the kids are actually up there. Um, there's this go-kart thing that's happening um, for like a Hot Wheels track. Right here, for the kids and everything. Um, there's also slushies and yeah, fruit slushies, coconut, fresh coconut juice, um, and everything. Um, all, all, all the barbecues here, each stand has their own uh, unique, um, how do you say, flavor, how they barbecue, how they marinate, um, how they cook their stuff, basically. And um, it, I'm still undecided. For me, it really doesn't matter how long I'm going to be. Um, I'm gonna be waiting for my food just as long as it tastes good. Um, I'm gonna be choosing one of these um, restaurants or these vendors and everything um, for my dinner tonight. And uh, I'll let you guys know what you th uh, what I think. All right, uh, let's wait in line. vendors and everything um, and uh, I wanted to see um, and decide also uh, depending on <laughs> what looks good basically what smells good um, and I have chosen Men and Joy's Men and Joy's barbecue uh, Men and Joy's barbecue uh, they I have known them for quite some time and everything um, when I was younger uh, at, at the flea market, the morning market that happens Saturdays and Sundays here on Guam, um, the, the parents actually, I know them, and after I guess um, you know they needed to retire and everything, uh, no offense, um, they passed it down to their kids and everything, so they took over. They kept the name, Men Enjoy, Men Enjoy Barbecue. Um, before actually I, I lined up, I actually asked if I can get a uh, preview of uh, you know their barbecue and everything their how do you say um, their grill basically <laughs> um, that you guys already seen and everything and um, how do you say uh, I've been waiting in line for about already five minutes um, it seems like it's just gonna give me a total of maybe like ten minutes waiting in line but I probably think it is really worth it um, and we'll see what they got um, whatever they suggest. All right. Again, um, let's wait. Waiting game. I got a diet drink. Um, I got red rice. Uh, the red rice is right there. This is the pork. This is the chicken barbecue. And I got the ribs. And of course, a side of corn. You gotta have your corn um, whenever you're eating and, um, you know, fiesta plate. So uh, let's go see how this tastes like. Food tasting. Okay, so first, uh, we're going to be tasting the ribs. We're gonna be tasting the ribs. Wow. The ribs are cooked as whole. This was easier, of course. And chopped up later on. Um, 
has a sweet and a little bit tiny flavor to it. Um, wow, and it's still tender. It's not dry. It's soft. Um, chicken. Chicken's pretty good. Chicken thigh. Um, very good, sweet, barbecue flavor, um, not overcooked actually, it's pretty good. Um, some barbecues um, that I tasted um, in the past, uh, here, probably at Tomorrow Village, I guess some other people like to overcook their stuff just so um, we want to make sure I guess it's already fully cooked maybe. Um, but the chicken, the barbecue chicken, um, it is pretty good. It's pretty awesome. Um, oh, the pork. This is the pork. Tender. Really tender. Tangy. Yeah, it's pretty good. It's tangy. It's wow. Um, I should have gotten the sausage. <laughs> um, I wanted to see how that tasted like. But there was a three choice. Um, I got three uh, three choices of meat, which is the ribs, um, the chicken, and the pork. Um, let's see the pork. Two corn. Nice, pretty good. And the red rice. With every, every fiesta thing you have, you gotta have your red rice. Very good. Not too wet, not too dry. Um, yeah, man, I mean, yeah, I guess it's pretty good and everything. Um, awesome. One of my uh, favorite uh, barbecue places back then was Men and Joy also at the tea market, or the morning market. Um, here also um, at the Chamorro Village um, Wednesday night market, um, there are other many choices um, to choose from. Um, I, I will be doing other uh, vlogs about it. Um, probably not on YouTube, but on my Facebook page, if you guys can um, go check that out also. I'm just not full vlogs, but just short video clips and everything. Uh, I'll probably check, uh, you know, please go ahead and check that out. Um, on Facebook, it's Rod Ventures as well. Don't forget to like the page. Um, if you haven't yet, go ahead and subscribe to this YouTube uh, video. I'd appreciate if you give a like, also leave that thumbs up. Um, and I'm gonna continue my food. And it's do not disturb mode right now, all right? $12 for that plate, um, comes with the ribs, um, barbecue chicken, and the barbecue pork. And then of course red rice and a side of corn. Was it worth the 12 bucks? Pretty much. Um, it is pretty good. Awesome taste wise. I'm not a professional food critic or anything, but uh, with me, um, $12 and that type of food with that type of taste, uh, quantity that's in there um, awesome um, I waited in line for about like, just about 10 minutes and um, was it worth the, the, the wait for 10 minutes it is it's worth um, the wait for 10 minutes it is worth 
for $12 and everything. Um, will I come back and eat Men & Joy's barbecue? Yes, of course. Most definitely. Um, again, but the next time I do come here, I want to try all the other ones and everything. So, uh, stay tuned for those mini vlogs and everything like that. My name is Rod Ventures. I hope you guys do leave a like on this video. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't. And um, the more support I get from you guys, the more vlogs will be coming out just for you guys, all right? Thank you very much, Ventures. Again, to do this